starts now. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Karen Lair. These days it seems like there's constantly a new building popping up in downtown Boise and many of them are new hotels, but are there now too many? Anna Silver explains how the city of trees is keeping them full. Some may wonder if there's a need for all the hotels here in downtown Boise, and the short answer is yes. Terry Kopp with the Boise Convention and Visitors Bureau says more than 400 sleeping rooms have been added to the downtown Boise area in the last few years. She says at any given time, hotels run at about 70% occupancy in that area. Business, sporting events, conventions, and tourism keep them busy. In fact, when a large convention does come into town, which can be a 800, 1,000 people, then they're using three or four hotels. To land a spot downtown, conventions have to book several years in advance. They can't call up a city six months before and say, we're looking at bringing our convention to your city because more than likely there won't be dates available. Kathy Pigeon, the general manager of the Riverside Hotel, says they hold quite a few conferences. And she says the other hotels going up hasn't been a bad thing. Boise has become more and more populated and more and more popular. It seems like every week you read about Boise being on some kind of a top 10 list. So I think that it's all based on supply and demand. And I think that there has been enough demand that it's been able to absorb a lot of the supply. Before we used to meet with clients and we would have to show them geographically where the state was located. And now they are saying, what is the buzz about Boise? What's, you know, why should we bring our meeting to Boise? And it's much easier um, to tell them that. Anna Silver, six on your side.